The 511 Rush 72 backpack is an end-user favorite worldwide and was engineered to be a full-featured 72-hour bag that provides ample space for gear and accessories while remaining rugged and reliable enough for extended excursions or tactical operations. The grab-and-go carry handle has been reinforced for rugged use. There's a fleece-lined pocket on the top of the pack for sunglasses or other sensitive gear. We've increased the padding in the strap as well as the width of the strap, allowing you to carry a heavier load for longer distances. The sternum straps are adjustable. The buckle hardware is located above the padded shoulder straps for greater comfort. The four zones of padding provide maximum ventilation. And the tacky rubber at the base helps keep your pack in place. Drain holes are located at the bottom of the strap to help keep your gear dry, as well as lashing straps for a tent or bed roll. The waist straps on the Rush 72 are covered in a web platform for ultimate customization and can be tucked away for a more discreet profile, and they also function as a lumbar support. A hydration bladder can be stored in the front compartment. This compartment comes with a back plate and an aluminum removable rod for support. Your hydration valve can be fed through the top of the pack and exit on the left or right side of the grab handle depending on your preference. The Rush tier system allows you to integrate other Rush bags with your pack for ultimate customization. The Rush 72 has a zippered compartment on each side of the pack that can each hold a full liter bottle as well as internal divider pockets for added utility. The upper zippered compartment has an internal pocket as well as a zippered mesh pocket to easily access and view your smaller items. There's an external shove it pocket on the outside of your pack for quick and easy storage of a bag, jacket, or other gear. This bag is covered in web platform for ultimate customization, and we've also added a spot for an ID or morale patch. Rain flaps cover your zippers, keeping your gear dry. The admin pocket has a wide variety of organizational options. A loose-fitting open sleeve pocket, as well as two secure lower pockets with retention straps give you plenty of options for storage. We've also added two key fobs. The open flap is also equipped with two large shove-it pockets that extend to the bottom of the pack and have retention straps at the top. The mesh pocket at the top is great for storage that you want visible. The mesh pocket at the top was designed with two zippered entry points for easy access from either side. The center mesh pocket as well as the lower pocket also have zippered entries to keep your gear separate. We've added additional web platforms throughout the pack. This is the 511 Rush 72 Backpack. You're going to get an accessory pouch up front. You're going to get a variety of places to store stuff and a variety of zip pockets across all three of these backpacks. Each backpack is going to offer you an ability to have another storage pouch. It's a small individual pocket that has a mesh pocket uh, and just an open space for accessories. The biggest thing that's going to change across this line of backpacks is size. 72 is going to offer you the most amount of space per pouch per zippered pocket. It's going to come down a little bit on the 24, and down a little bit more on the 12. 24 opens up, you're going to have the mesh pocket so you can see what's in there. The laptop storage area, it's got a good uh, little retention system. And this is your sunglass pouch accessible just above the yoke padded to protect your lenses and your goggles. And all three also, while we're right here at the carrying handle, give you the ability to route the hydration hose. The front end of the pouch got three pockets. Two of them are mesh. One of them is an enclosed nylon pouch. Let's talk about the back. First and foremost, you have the yoke. It's got awesome padding. It's spread wider to help you push that load across your shoulder. All three of the backpacks have a chest attachment point and are adjustable for a variety of uh, heights and sizes. Underneath the yoke, you have a padding and air channelization system designed to not only keep the backpack in place with some friction panels to help with the ventilation. One additional thing that you're gonna have here on the 24 is an introduction of a side pouch where you can store the Nalgene bottle, Tactical World, you can put an M4 magazine in there. O series. When we unveiled the Rush series, it established a high watermark for backpacks. But we didn't rest on our laurels. We engineered our next iteration based on responses from around the globe and set another new standard with the Rush 2.0. With a hidden compartment, padded laptop storage, and three different sizes to choose from, this backpack is loaded with features that are practical, modular, and innovative. 
Choose from 24, 37, or 55 liters of capacity, all with standard eyewear and hydration compartments, as well as a removable backboard. The backpack that launched a million missions is gearing up to conquer a million more. Whether you're setting out for duty or adventure, the only limit to the Rush 2.0 series is your imagination. The Covert 18, designed to support you for 18 hours. This backpack is designed to have all of the features that you'd expect in a tactical backpack, but on a little bit more of a lower profile frame. First thing you're gonna find is this uh, group of accessory pouches. On the outside of that, you have these micro attachment points. They're great for carabiners and smaller items that you're gonna to wanna to hook into the outside of your bag. It looks like they might access the same pocket, but they actually don't. One goes in and the other one comes in. So you got two layered pockets right on top of each other. It's gonna open up to the front pouch. You've got a whole Molly system inside, just above that. And give you access to a much deeper than it looks like uh, accessory pouch as well. And here you're gonna find your, uh, your admin pouch, room for your pencils, business cards, a knife, a flashlight, and a small hook in if you want to. You wanna throw your car keys on there. Two side. Uh, fast text that's going to help you guys compress the load down uh, and really help shape that backpack, keep it nice and tight. When you guys get your hands on this backpack, you're going to notice that there's plastic tabs on all the zippers except for two. This type of pull tab that has the little plastic gripper, and then this pull tab that does not. And there's a specific reason for that. The one without the plastic, when you pull it, it gives you access to a little bit more of a tactical pocket. It has a Velcro patch here. You could put a holster on, you could put your credentials on. These tabs in this pocket here is just designed to make sure that you're going to the right pocket the first time, every time. On the sides, we have two nice elastic uh, rimmed pouches with drawstrings, Nalgene bottles, shoes for working out, whatever you want to throw in there. Let's dig into the main pouch. Two awesome mesh pockets with uh, zipper access. Up top here, this is going to be the inside of your sunglass or tactical goggle pouch little Velcro retain strap. You can put your laptop in here, your file folder, whatever you need to have, make sure it's retained, it's padded. It's got a very sturdy carrying handle. It's got the shoulder straps with the yoke system. In front, it obviously has the fast tech connection point. If you want to bring the load a little bit in on your shoulders, not only the padding on the shoulders is a little bit beefed up, but you can see there's padding that goes down. It's leaving a channelized space for your spinal column. This is for ventilation, for padding. Another option you're going to have is the pocket for either a laptop or this tab is going to hold the bladder portion of your hydration system. There's everything you need. Covert 18, 18 hours in the field use.
The 511 All Hazard Nitro has a durable construction and was designed to be a carry-on, patrol bag, or long-range tactical kit. The dual main compartments offer a 180-degree opening for easy access. We've added loop patches at the sides and top for a name tag or ID. The pass-through slots allow you to store longer implements like breaching tools or a baton. There's a generous amount of web platform which is Molly and SlickStick system compatible. The bright orange lining on the interior allow you to identify your gear in low light conditions. The All Hazard Nitro has a bucket lid opening and supports a removable ammo jack or ammo mule. There's an all-purpose shove it pocket along with an oversized sunglass pocket. The comfortable yoke shoulder system allows you to carry a heavier load for longer distances. There's an adjustable and removable sternum strap. We've also added a reinforced handle at the top for quick grab and go access. The four padded areas at the back provide added cushioning and allow for optimal airflow. The admin pocket was designed to allow you to carry all your essential gear while keeping you organized. The compression straps allow you to keep your gear secure. The smaller pocket on the exterior has a zippered opening for quick access. We've also added additional handles at the base. This is the 511 All Hazards Nitro.